guys, let me finish uh, uh, sharing it out and I'll give it to you guys. <clears throat> Hi guys, it's me, Mystical Darkest Eighty Nine. I am continuing with the DLC, a village called Shadows of Rose. I hope everybody's doing well. Hello again, uh, uh, Twilight Girl. I hope everybody's doing well. And let's just finish this game. Thank you for coming back though. rather get hit because I hate being stealthy. Oh man! Don't have health. Fuck. Yeah, 
Yes. Because it's Stark. So many. They see me, I'm toast. There's gotta be something I can do. Fuck. Just have to get past them. There you go. Oh. Oh, jeez. Ruby, how you doing? Okay, fuck, fuck, fuck. Okay. That's good. Damn it.
Thank you. Yep. That's why don't get don't don't get caught. Gladly to give me a herb. Thank you. My heart's racing, you guys. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on.
Finally found you. Let's go. Whew. Oh my god. I fucking hate those dolls. I can't take much more of this. Why are they talking about my dad? I never even met him. No. I don't know. I don't know the first thing about him. I wish I did. All I know is he died protecting me. Sometimes I try to imagine what my life would have been like if he hadn't died. But he have taught me to ride a bike, helped me with my homework, got me a story every night. Would he have been there for me, proud of me? Sometimes when I feel lost or afraid, Try to imagine what he might have said to me. Where are we? You're safe here. It feels... Familiar, like I've been here before. Look at all the decorations. Some kind of party? to do decorate the living room done get the wine and put it in dining room yup rose's other presents and study hidden yep So little. <laughs> Hard to believe one day she'll be old enough to share a bottle of wine with her old man. What's that voice? Never, Daniela. I'm almost done with this game. <laughs> this must be my parents' house from when I was a baby. I bet other things also have my dad's memories. She bangs her spoon every time I play this. I wonder if she'll be a musician. I wonder if Dad played any instruments. <laughs> she just cannot get enough of this stuff. <laughs> Never, Daniela. How are you? <laughs> Welcome back. Welcome back, everybody. Take your time to look around. <laughs> Rose is such a picky eater. All she ever wants is fruit puree. <laughs> I guess I've always had I never played Assassin's Creed. You're welcome. <laughs> I played it before. Ah, uh, Katie. Thank you. Upstairs? I'll take a look. I never played it. What? This tune has always it's been special good. for our family. I think I've heard this before. It's pretty. <laughs> oh my god, I didn't make did it upset you, Daniela. I am so sorry. That's good. 
This is my bedroom. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. She's growing so fast. Getting bigger every day. This crib is so little. She's already growing out of these onesies? I can't believe I was ever this tiny. <laughs> Sorry. One more. Nice. Yeah, let me, let me check everything else. Ethan, don't forget. Rose's half birthday is on the second. I'm going to make an amazing cake, so you better eat it. In fact, I'm going to make cake for every special occasion we have. I want you to take lots of pictures for our family album. I haven't seen mom in ages. I, I know. <laughs> She's probably a little too young for this, but it was too cute. I wonder how we played with this. Let me handle it, um, um, Katie. I'll do it. Thank you. Let me just observe it. Thank you. I appreciate the help, but sometimes I will watch it on my own. Thank you. I'm so lucky to have you both in my life. Dad. Got it. Thank you, though. I just, I'm glad that your back is feeling better. I'm glad. <laughs> February 2nd is Rose's half birthday, half a year of a brink of an eye. I wanted to capture this moment. These feelings, I wrote something special. I have gotten a bit sappy though. I feel embarrassed if anyone stumbles across it. So it's safe in the sideboard for now. The key is behind my favorite photo. Yeah, that's good. I'm glad. I wonder if she'll look like me when she grows up. Oh, I looked so happy. Baby Rose! Look at baby Rose. Oh, baby Rose. Baby Rose. Baby Rose. Woo okay, I'll stop. <laughs> I don't want you guys getting sick. I know she is cute. I, I stopped because I don't want you guys getting sick. Right? She does. She actually does. A very small, like, younger version. Yep. <laughs> A letter for me. Happy <laughs> half birthday, Rose. My gift to you is a promise. I'll always be there for you. People get motion sickness, you know, uh, but a lot of 
a lot of um, I'll be there. a lot of motion. People I'll get sick. Until you fall back asleep. You know, motion sickness. I'll hug you tight when you're troubled or worried, and tell you that everything's mm. gonna be all right. You are my precious rose. Never forget that, Dad. Hmm. No one loves you. <laughs> Fucking Michael, Evelyn. Michael, help! Michael! No! <laughs> right? <laughs> Oi, this little bitch. <laughs> yeah. God, I hate this little Guess bitch. What? That thing you're looking for? Isn't here. <laughs> so, you don't have the purifying crystal? <laughs> of course not. <laughs> For that, you'll have to go deeper. Much deeper. Poor Rose. <gasps> She can't trust anyone. <laughs> Why are you doing this? <laughs> no one. I'm sorry. <laughs> when you're dead, no one will care. <laughs> oh, shut up. Enough. Beat your ass. Now you'll drown. I came first. First. Does she only want you? What are you talking nice. about? Well, I... I'll play it later. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. You guys bombarded me! Shit. Okay. That's cool. You guys got... I got distracted. <laughs> Enough. Drown. Yep, I that's so true. First. First? Why does she only want you? What are you talking about? Look at you! You are beyond worthless! Seriously, what is your problem? Okay, can't go back that way. Okay. Yeah, she's still in her imaginative, you know, state. Just so greedy. Come on, you sons of bitches. Where do you think you are? Oh look, you're free of me. <laughs> Fuck. That is yes, it is beyond scary. Yep. Oh shit. Oh no. Nope, nope, nope. Ah! Yep. God, I hate this. I have to do this shit again? Fuck! Problem! 
Thank you, but I never want to go through that again. Fuck that. I'm trying to get the hell out of there. Thank you. They were supposed to die. I'm and trying to save it for here. Evelyn. <laughs> Let's go. What? Get him. Get that bitch. next time. I'm just gonna <laughs> do that before. Evelyn? That little girl? <laughs> you can still get out. <laughs> That's funny. I can do this.
And fuck off. Okay. Fuck you, you little fucker. I can't believe how useless I am. Right? No wonder no one loves me. What now? Back This is all your fault. And I will never let you out. Well, 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 look who's here. Don't give up, Rose. Well, right? Like multiple times. <laughs> Make sure she's old, she's dead. <laughs> Yep, yeah, Ethan is here. Michael? Are you there? It's not Michael! Rose, look out! He... He saved me. But he didn't make it. Why, he alive? Or hi, how you doing? Don't give up, Rose. Find that crystal. Because of him, I can keep going. I have. 
have to find that crystal. I'm on my own, but I have to keep going. What's all this doing out here? Is this place? That's not creepy at all, you guys. Let's see. Lots of challenges. Alright, need one more. Alright. Hey, yeah, yeah, Esmeralda, how you doing? Yeah. It's all good. Good. That's good to hear. Hope you're doing well. <laughs> yeah, like this is not creepy at all, look. That's not creepy at all, right? <laughs> That's good, I'm doing well, thank you. That's not weird at all. The 
megamycete absorbs the memories of all life within its reach, but there are laws which govern this world within. It seems worthwhile to catalog them as they become apparent. Yep. One, the memories that that comprise this realm do not strictly reflect reality. Right? Two, those who are attuned to the mutamycete in the life retain control of their faculties here in this realm. This aligns... This aligns with my understanding of the Mega My Seat as revealed to me as in its visions before my death. Yes, my death. My physical body is gone, absorbed into the Mega My Seat, and yet I do not despair for this fate has granted me fascinating insights. All those years I strived, have continued to strive. They are not for nothing. The memories are consciousness, understanding, and knowledge I accumulated in life have transferred into the Mega My Seat. Where it serves as a source of power within this realm. If I can harness this power, I can believe I can use it to affect the thoughts and memories of others. I know, you'll like it. Of course, it's hardly a perfect arrangement. With so many minds and memories gathered here, fighting and retrieving a single person from amidst, for the rebel has proven an immense challenge. Her memories are here, yes, but dissolute. Perhaps what is needed is the right vessel into which to hold her. And of course, I know of the perfect vessel and the only real candidate in all my years of searching, Rosemary Winters. Thank you. I had intended to duplicate Rosemary Winters with the hope that a perfect replica might serve as a suitable vessel. However, the results were less than ideal. It would seem that some sort of interference is preventing me from creating a uh, suitable replica. Instead, I have succeeded in making what is... Instead of sitting and making what is essentially a living doll, it resembles a real living thing, yes, but has no power. Such a pathetic husk could never prove suitable as a vessel. No, you can't. There's no unlimited ammo. She has powers of her own. I will continue my efforts in hopes of this, sur- this um, concerning the sources of this interference. Interference. Several hypotheses have come to mind thus far. One, the fact that, that Rose herself is still alive. Two, some other actor um, other actor within this realm. Three, a flaw in my methods of production. None of this seems especially is likely to be sole reason nor of any easy problems to solve. Perhaps that the best of bring Rose into this realm where she will offer herself as a vessel it will be so simple. It is most powerful. If you played the um, village first and you're playing playing Shadow of Rose, I recommend you playing Shadow of Rose and asking all these questions. I cannot answer for you. Additional observations, further experiments with these war- rose copies, I have, yeah, as I have taken to calling these husks, yet yeah, have yielded another interesting wrinkle to pursue, pursue. When subjected to situations evoking extreme terror, they actually begin to express some semblance of Rose's ability. De- this warrants much more research. And yet, that my first creation, the Mask Duke, is just one to perform this stress test. They couldn't have been watching me the entire time. Could they? 
It would seem at some point during my experiments with consciousnesses, uh, an intruder made herself at home in my room. This intruder was no other than the failure Evelyn, who had been running about reenacting her own pitiful agenda, which had let has led to a slight disruption in my own plans. Had Evelyn not interfered, Rosemary Winters could have been on the verge of despair. Disposedness of her will to live and her mutamycet powers. Instead, a new passion burns with her. I shall have to extinguish it. Make sure I got everything here. Okay, good. All right. Let's go. Okay. Yeah, there's nothing wrong with a lot of first aid. Obviously. There's that feeling again. It's so strong. It must be the crystal. I'm almost there. Michael. Hey, dragon. That pool I've been feeling is close, but I just can't go any further. I thought I, may I had made it when I saw that blue light, but no, not quite. If only I'd been braver, faster, stronger. So close. I was so close. Black God, which lives in us and in which we live, create for us a new world as benefits your will. Your dark consciousness holds for us a second chance, graciously offered a joylessly accepted. Your drink, the blood of the lost lamb, as it falls upon your darkened earth, not to destroy, but to preserve. Once again, deliver unto life. Yep. <laughs> Sacrifice. Just kidding. How are you, dragon? <laughs> yes. Blow. <laughs> That's good. I'm okay. That's good to hear.
They're making a big mistake. They're making a big mistake. That's all I can say. Oh my god. Why are you asking so many questions? Just watch it. Just watch it and play the game. I'm not gonna answer the questions. Just watch it, please. So I understand you want to ask a lot of questions, but watch it. Play the game. You understand My it more. You would become so powerful. Far too powerful for me to subdue directly. So, I had to lure you into this realm so that you might. <laughs> right? <laughs> He said, did he, or did I? That was an illusion. Very convincing, wouldn't you say? No way. Now you can become the vessel for my Eva! Yes, she is. Big time. She looks good for over a hundred, right? Oh. <laughs> Come on, we're ready to see your face, Ethan! <laughs> Ethan, you pest! Go! <sighs> he can manifest. He can see you, Rose! No one can. Rose! Rose, hurry! You can't escape! Not from me! Yes, but right now you need to run. Right? Run! <laughs> right? He's like, ha. Ah. <laughs> that would be funny. She's, he's like, you're on your own, kid. Why didn't you uh, need my really jacket were? back. <laughs> Why didn't you let me call you Michael? I didn't want to complicate things. I just needed you safe. <laughs> and I'm sorry I left you alone. But I had to find a way out. And I did. It's just ahead. Rose! <laughs> <laughs> right? Stay away from my family. He's like, there, there now, child. This is my my jacket. <laughs> you can't escape. Ethan, persistence is all we. Rose, now's your chance. Go live a normal life. Make friends. No one will ever call you a freak again. But... Rose, just go! I don't want to leave you! I know. I know. I love you. But I need to know that you're safe. So please, just... Ethan, you insolent pest! I got this. Get out of here. Break the crystal and get your powers back. <laughs> the Rise of Cloud. <laughs> Starring Joe Valentine, Chris Redfield, Leon Kennedy, Claire, Claire Redfield, Ada Wong, Sherry Birkin. Foolish. How intent they were on my throwing them away. I think 
Oh, no way, no way to do this. What? Don't resist. <laughs> My life has been a lie. There's nothing to see. I didn't know this power. I could have seriously avoid her like that. Looks like Wesker. Look. <laughs> Offer yourself unto me. <laughs> this will all soon be. She looks like fucking Albert Wesker. Good night, MZ. <laughs> Have a good one. This. So cool. Why do you Dada? <laughs> Let's see this power. Offer yourself unto me. Right? He's like, you got this. Now give me back my coat. <laughs> Nothing. It took so much to lure. 
But you're incredible! Well... No! Your time is at me. Now! Think of me. I called him to this world within the Mega My Seat to resurrect my sweet dog. But no matter how many this is It must be you. You are the only one who can bring her back. Whatever it takes, whatever I must do, I will see this through. This is so cool. You will fall. This is so cool. It made my battle life easier. The hell? There will be whaling and Now I know. Yeah, baby. There's nothing. <laughs> right? Dude, Daniela, if you're still here, you get all the coke. <laughs> okay. Offer yourself unto me. Damn it. I got cocky. How about this? There is 
no victory. There you go. I did it. For now. <laughs> They're gonna fart on each other, you guys. Daniela, he's she's finally gonna give her back the the uh <laughs> the uh coat back. Sorry, I couldn't protect you. All you've ever done is protect me. No. Not this time. You lost your chance. I'm so sorry. No. It was my choice. Thank you. And I don't regret it one bit. If I had left you, then we never would have had this chance to talk face to face. You got lost skinny milk. <laughs> I'm back. Dad. Yeah. <laughs> Do you think the little boy will be able to touch the moon? Nobody can touch the moon. It's too far away. Wait, what if he has a rocket ship? Uh, okay. Then you can touch it, but it'd be very, very cool. You were being silly. I don't <laughs> think that we would be able to catch you. <laughs> Do 
Yep. Hey, Dad. Happy birthday. Sorry I missed last week. I have a lot of tests coming up. You know how it is. Talk to the goddamn devil. Duty calls. I love you. Hmm. Yeah, I found her. Where else? Today of all days. We have a situation. You're needed, Evelyn. Don't you ever call me that again. Whoa, whoa, it's just a joke, Rose. I can show you things even Chris doesn't know I can do. Yeah, put him in his place. Put that asshole in his place. Stand down. There you have it, guys. Thank you. Now I know. When I first played it, I had trouble not knowing now I can do that. Sadly, I don't think he is. Thank you. He's not alive. Or people think. Thank you. He's not alive. I liked it. I played it before. I I I didn't stream it. I played it before. I liked it. But now I know what I missed. So I'm glad I played it again and I'm glad I got to stream it for you guys. Yeah. It was a little too short, but it would have been a lot more better. But it's a, it's great. Yep, big time. And you just missed it, Efford. You missed it.
the whole thing. Yeah, I'm going good. Starting to finally stream this. It's all good. Nice. Gotta redo this though. Well, there you have it, you guys. Resident Evil Village, the DLC, Shadows of Rose, has been completed. You guys are amazing. And I will think of another game to play. You guys are cool, hip, and if you're new, go ahead and subscribe, give it a like, give it a dislike, it's okay. Comments, please keep it courteous and respectful, and I will continue with another new game. And you guys are amazing. I'll see you guys in the next run. Take care all of you all. Love you guys. Bye. They didn't. See you guys later. Bye.